Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to let you know about a recent update for Windows Subsystem for Android. If you are following the development um, of WSA, which as I've mentioned previously, allows you to be able to run Android apps on Windows 11, as many of you would know. And also as mentioned um, previously is not available to all regions currently. Um, unfortunately, I'm still not in a region where WSA is supported. But nonetheless, uh, this update has rolled out for Windows Subsystem for Android on Windows 11 to the WSA preview program. So just take note of that. Still not available to the general public and is still in testing. Now, um, this update takes the version from version 2303 and bumps it up to version 2304.40,000.3.0. And according to Microsoft, we'll add package verification, improved reliability, and app link support. Now, I would consider the key highlight uh, for this recent update to be that um, you now have the ability, if you are testing WSA, um, to configure how much memory to assign to Android, as we can see. So yeah, we can see if you click on this custom toggle, um, you can assign a low amount, 2 gigabytes, default 6 gigabytes, and ha 16 gigabytes and now as mentioned um if you have enough ram available you can actually assign a custom amount of ram which um, at the end of the day um will obviously then um, give you a bit of a performance boost when using wsa um, on your windows 11 system and this will be found just to give you a, a kind of a wider view um, on the Windows subsystem for Android settings page. And yeah, we can see once again, you can allocate a custom amount of RAM by clicking on these settings available and just customizing that to your own personal choice and preference, which will bring a nice performance boost, which I think is a nice move uh, in the right direction. Now, some other little um, uh, improvements that have rolled out, just to mention for the purpose um, of this video, if you would be interested, um, is package verification for apps on WSA. So that means Android apps now are scanned using antivirus software installed on Windows prior to app installation. So as an example, it will use your default antivirus installed um, on Windows to scan those apps and um, before they are actually, those Android apps before they are actually installed. And um, another one is um, Android apps now will be launched when a user opens the supported app link from any app that's the Android app link support as mentioned. And then the Linux kernel itself has been updated to version 5.15.94. And um, they've also rolled out some maintenance updates with WSA reliability and performance improvements also being made available. So that's the latest version, version 2304 now available um, and rolling out to WSA preview program. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.